What I know is that my family come first. And by the age of 26, I had already experienced my fair share of loss and failure. Losing my father and my grandmother, and almost losing my business, and almost going bankrupt, has actually made me stronger. I bet you didn't know that. <laughs> Those who doubted me had only made me wiser. I always follow, follow my gut. And guess what? I don't always win. And I am comfortable with that. I am constantly learning. Learning ways always helps me to reduce my fear, to knock down walls, so that I can be comfortable to understand and move forward. So what I believe is, relationships lead to success. No matter how technical and or how automated this world becomes, opportunities come through people. You must always stay humble. People may forget what you may have said, but they will never forget how you made them feel. Make every connection with good faith and that it truly counts and matters. So my whittle to you, and it's a whittle my grandmother told me about in regards to the pupu harakeke that I wear around my neck. She told me that this pupu harakeke was a warning to her people when battle was coming. That it would sound a wailing pitch that would give them warning to leave or to fight. So, this is my whittle to you. If you are in business, take that leadership by the horns and you fight. Never give up. The only time you give up is when your time is done. Thank you again for the recognition and thank you again to my Fano and our friends that have made this opportunity happen for Kaiora, my Fano, and our area up in Taitokero, and our people throughout New Zealand. Ngā mihi nui ki a koutou katoa. Kia ora.